Okay, so Quavo is allegedly dating Miss Erica Fontaine. My understanding is that she's a gymnast. So we can briefly look into what's going on with them. I only seen I've only seen um YouTube videos. I haven't seen anything else uh in regards to their relationship. So we can ask what's going on between Quavo and Erica Fontaine spirit? What's going on between Quavo and Erica Fontaine? Seven of Cups, a lot of confusion. King of Swords inverted. Queen of Wands, she is very beautiful. And then we have the Ten of Swords. One more. Pixie Stomp, don't, don't go there. The Wheel of Fortune, okay. Nine of Pentacles, so we're going from a page to a knight. Uh, hmm. Now I'm open. Give me more about the top row, because the top row is way different from the bottom. She's worried about people bullying her in the sense that like, you know, when you start dating a celebrity, how next thing you know, you're under a microscope just like they are. Um, people making comments. It, it, I would, I would, I, I can understand this energy. It's like the queen, it like this um, page of wands inverted landed right, landed right on top of the queen of wands. Uh, well, although she knows she's extremely beautiful, it, the internet can be an ugly place, so I don't blame her for having concerns about that. Give me more about that. Yeah, the high priestess. She knows who this is. Oh, yeah, she knows. Give me more about the first two. Mm -hmm. So, if I had to say, I would say Erica's the top row and Quavo's the bottom row. I'm going to tell you guys why. And then the Queen of Cups inverted is peeking out. She's confused. I think she likes Quavo a lot. I think he's nice. But one thing she is, is she isn't stupid. Uh, and she's heard that, you know, she's seen what he's done to women in the past. Uh, allegedly cheated on Sweetie. And, you know, just... Uh, she's trying to determine if she can take him seriously or not. But then that's when we have this issue with Quavo in this somewhat evolution. The Ten of Swords ending... Page of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, and then the Wheel of Fortune. He's getting, it's almost like he's changed, maybe he's somewhat changing his player ways. And, but we have the Queen of Cups right here inverted. So there would be lingering women, not necessarily that he's interested in them, but we would have some women that are not very happy that he is he moves on. And I don't think it's Sweetie. It's definitely, it can't be her. It's like other women he's dealt with. Like maybe side chicks he had when he dealt with Sweetie or like, you know, the, what is this? The Empress. I knew it. It wanted to come out, then it went back in. Nope, bring your butt all out here. Let me see. And then we have the Ten of Pentacles inverted. Give me more. Ooh. They might get pregnant. <laughs> they... We got the Ten of Cups upright, the Eight of Wands upright, and then the Empress right here. There may be somewhat of an unplanned or unexpected pregnancy. Give me more about the Ten of Pentacles inverted. The Two of Swords. The Ace of Swords. So... If Quavo sues QC, it's not going to go in his way. Judgment inverted at the bottom. Uh, and there may be some financial issues. Uh, someone said that he's the worst rapper out of Migos. I really ain't never compared and contrasted them. But I do know Takeoff was better than um, both of them. Well, I guess I could say Quavo is the worst rapper in Migos. It, he has some concerns over his financial future. 
because now Migos is no more. He's he's by himself, and I did hear one song he put out. It wasn't. I wouldn't listen to it again. Uh, let's look more into this energy around him. Give me a second. I'm gonna write something down. about Quavo's energy around his his concerns surrounding his financial situation six of swords reversed the hermit reversed mm. the knight of swords upright Sometimes you gotta know when to let it go, Quavo. So what you would end up doing, he would end up doing is losing a lot of money in attorney fees, court fees, all that. Um, it's better just to take what you got and move on. Continuously trying to fight this. If you do sue, um, QC is not worth it. It's not worth it. And you know it's not worth it. He knows it. But he does does it anyway. That went with Quavo, there's a lot of ego. A whole lot of ego. Give me more. I'm gonna look at some rich. No, that's not the one I like. Yep, exactly what I've been thinking. Then we have the seven of wands here. He, um, he's his own worst enemy. He's gonna be his own downfall. If he don't learn to let it go and move on, it will be detrimental to him. So maybe that is the, what's directly gonna affect his, his financial situation if he doesn't let it go. Nine of Pentacles inverted, yep. I don't know what's up with him, but let me see. Okay, see. Judgment is here upright. Eventually, he may get the freaking picture and learn that, you know what, it's, it's best just to move on. Give me more. Yeah. Two of Cups can indicate. Um, so he may reconcile with QC, but it also can indicate a contractual agreement. The Two of Cups is like the, the lesser version of the lovers. So maybe she has some type of influence in him letting this go. The Queen of Swords is right here, so she's very intelligent. Three of Swords inverted, Page of Swords, and then the Five of Swords. Then the Moon inverted. There's always going to be this this concern with Erica, with Quavo, and his ability to be faithful. And I don't blame you. Especially when it's so freaking public. Um, I don't know how to act. I don't want to ask this. He gonna be faithful? Shit. I mean, that's just this. That would only make that question good for today. Well, what has Quavo changed? The Empress is inverted. The Eight of Pentacles is right here. The um, Magician is right here, upright. But the Queen of Cups is peeking out, and behind that's the Lovers, and then the Ace of Pentacles. Oh, this is weird. At least to me, it's weird. I don't know. Let's see, where's the Kipper? It's not the Kipper. Occupation is right here. Okay, make oh, okay, so maybe a pregnancy. So since she's a gymnast, you know, that would um put her out of work. That would stress him out, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Give me a second. Let me keep looking. Pathway. Maybe within the next two years they she could get pregnant if she's still dealing with him. Just 
privileged lady and then marriage is at the bottom um it'll take her a while to trust him fully i say in two to three years if they keep it going steady they could get married um there is this energy of him maybe not being so happy about the baby up front at least i thought that was it but then i looked at it as if the empress inverted to this occupation it would her pregnancy would somewhat hinder her um career now she, I, she would be happy about the baby for sure but it would put her she would have to take a step back because she's pregnant i don't know if she still does anything like as a gymnast but if she does it would you know be detrimental but even when they retire they you know they go and become coaches and do different things um let's do this i'm gonna go into the seven bill tarot love oracle This situation requires discernment, pay attention. So yeah, you have every right, Erica, to uh, be go slow. Tracking your location. We got a queen of cups inverted. That's mad as a motherfucker. Losing or lost my job. So that's that, yeah, that's that income situation with her maybe not being able to do some type, some gigs because of a pregnancy. And then him losing money, trying to fight everything. You should never have to tell a man how to love you. See, at the bottom, we are equal give and take. I'm doing one more and I'm done. He doesn't miss you. He only misses how you feel. This in, in obsession is at the bottom. We Yeah, we have a woman that's obsessed with him. It's not, in, sweetie. It's another woman that he dealt with on the side. Uh, maybe she thought she was going to get promoted when he broke him and sweetie broke up. But no girlfriend. Um, once a side piece, always a side piece. The only side, the biggest side piece that had the best come up in history is um, Camilla Parker Bowles, um, King Charles' wife. I mean, I ain't never seen nothing like it. Oh, rip Pr Princess Diana. I cannot stand Camilla. But yeah, that's all I got for them now. I think that this is, I think this energy is very, um, I think this is the energy we would expect considering his track record in relationships in the past in the media. And she seems to have a very, uh, a good head on her shoulders and she's not going into this naive or acting like, well, it don't mean he gonna do it with me. She she fully knows what he is capable of and she's truly um, aware of that. Now that baby is where we get the, uh, the monkey wrench and we're like, wait a minute now, but you know, if she she's if she's as smart as her energy has presented it to be she'll take she'll take necessary measures to not get pregnant to prevent a pregnancy if she doesn't want one so until next time i love you guys